The energy is flowing through these things are interestingly enough becoming more and more dense. If you take the amount of energy that flows through one gram volume per second in a galaxy, it's increased when you go through a star, and it's increased in life. We think of the sun as being a hugely immense amount of energy, yet the amount of energy running through a sunflower per gram per second of the livelihood of that sunflower is greater than in the sun. Animals have a higher energy usage than a plant. A jet engine has a higher than an animal. The most energy dense thing that we know about in the entire universe is the computer chip in your computer. It is sending more energy per gram volume per second through than anything which we know. In fact, if it were to send it any faster, it would melt or explode. It is so energy dense that it is actually at the edge of explosion. Look what is coming. Technology stitching together all of the minds of the living, wrapping the planet in a vibrating cloak of electronic nerves, entire continents of machines conversing with one another, the whole aggregation watching itself through a million cameras posted daily 48 minutes, 48 hours of video are uploaded to YouTube in every day. There are 6 billion minutes of human life lived in every in every minute that's over 11 millennia soon that 11 millennia will be recorded and put on youtube every minute free willing romantic insight wrapped in unfolding bliss aesthetic awe ever present i get sad when i'm distracted from all this if it doesn't happen every day i want Godhead all the time. I want freedom from fear, freedom from death, immortality now, the static continuity of self feeding on transcendent stimuli, an emergence of patterns and a ballooning, a euphoric self wrenching around reality. Albert Camus said that life should be lived to the point of tears. Our computer chip is on the edge of explosion. Your mind, when you have a profound experience, something which is thought to be mind expanding, heart breaking, meaningful, successful, and achievement, a declaration of your being. All that you've done is you've increased the amount of energy flowing through your neurons, the amount of energy per gram volume per second. You are literally inching up on exceeding your totality. That is what it feels like. You're living on the edge of full actualization of your potential. That is why it feels that way, that's why it feels so good, because that is what you as a human were born and meant to do. That is what meaning is. That is why we exist. I'm gonna teach you a song now. It's called, uh, it's from the movie Titanic. And uh, I learned this by ear, and uh, it's pretty simple. You can do it. There's only three parts to practice in the left hand. All you do is this. You take the black keys, you pick the first one of the two, and the middle one of the three. And you do this. If you've never learned how to play piano, everybody will like this song, including you. I think it really speaks to something internal that is commonly shared by all human beings. Maybe, I mean, maybe there's people that don't like this song, but I like it. So, just do this. 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 And then do it individually. This is called C sharp. Now we're going to do the second one. See the threes? We'll start here. These two notes are identical because this whole thing is just mapped up. It's a copy. So we're going to do.
can't really show you both hands at once, but it's really easy to put together. I think I might have gotten it like the first time. So I think you can do it well. I was wondering what the definition of machine was yeah or and it goes with life too pretty well but and, and maybe, maybe all things are I don't I think whatever I was thinking yesterday I think it was right or it made sense and it was that life is a if life living living processes are entropy funnels because you can't get rid of entropy but you can't funnel it because entropy is simply the recognition that there is a direction to energy, that energy tends to disperse. So what life does is that when the energy disperses, it funnels whatever energy is coming at it, and it makes it go in a certain path, and then it comes out. And then, but as it comes out, I mean, the structure of the funnel is literally, it's, it's literally warped in on itself. Because it's not just a funnel, but it, it's a funnel that creates itself. Because it has to keep its own... The like funnel's a process, and it has to keep the process going by re constantly rebuilding the process. You know, that's like the Krebs cycle and the you know, electron transport chain. But all it is is entropy being forced on a particular... Not being forced, but because you can't change entropy. But you can, you can focus it. You can funnel it. 